In our previous video, where we showed how to get some Twitch emotes done through Fiverr, we come to find out that there was no transparency in the background. No, not a PNG. So, dude, you want me to show you how to make it a transparent Please, emote? Please, because whether it's Photoshop or GIMP, I don't know what I'm doing. Can All you right, show me? let's do that right now. Hi, I'm Walt. And I'm Dale. Welcome to Live Streaming Tech. And if you want to learn to stream on platforms such as Twitch, Mixer, DLive, and beyond, make sure that you subscribe and hit the little bell notification icon so you don't miss a single video. So this past video, as I mentioned, we ordered an emote through Fiverr and it didn't have a transparent background. Now, rather than me, you know, putting up a big stink about it, I would rather just go ahead and do this really fast. And in fact, it's so fast, I'm gonna show you guys and gals how to do it. And it's using a free software called GIMP. You know GIMP, right? Yep. All right, so it's let's free. get yeah, let's get behind the dashboard. I'll show you how fast it is. Cool. Okay, you wanna start it off first of all, go to GIMP dot org slash download to get yourself a free copy of GIMP. It's 100% free. It's open source software. Everybody's able to use it. So I'm going to go ahead and open it on up. And by the way, I misspoke. It is a PNG file. It's just not transparent. Right. And it doesn't have the that was your main complaint. Yeah. And that was my big complaint. So now I've got this open and we've got the canvas already set. Then we're going to go on ahead and drop the image right onto the canvas. Okay. And so it's dropped it in here automatically. It's a pretty large size. It's 681 by 654. It's a good idea to have have your image square and I'm going to show you how simple that is to kind of make it all squared out. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to grab the magic wand tool. Next thing we're going to go ahead and do is we're going to create a transparent layer. We're going to put it right over top of that bear. All right. Now let's select the bear. We're going to hit the white background. This is super, super simple. We're going to go back to the layer. And since our foreground and background color is already set, I'm just going to hit Control and the comma. Now, if you're using Mac, it's going to be Command and comma. All right, we're going to hit Control I to invert it, and then we're going to hit Control period to fill it with white. All right, Control Shift A will deselect it. Now, what we want to do is copy this layer. We're going to hit Control C, shut off the layer, right click on the Mad Panda PNG or your image itself. We're going to add, add layer mask. Hit Add. Perfect. Control V. We'll paste it right over top of it. We're going to anchor it. And the next thing we're gonna do is let's go ahead and apply that layer mask. So now it is all set. So here's what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna right click on it, alpha to selection. We're gonna go over here, fit canvas to selection. So now it's kind of snugged up. It's at 266 by 235, control shift A will deselect it. We need this to be square in order for it to kind of work for the Twitch emotes. Yeah. So all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go up into image again, go to canvas size, and then we can go 266. All right, so that way it is all set. We're gonna hit center too, so that way it centers. Here we go, and it resizes it. Now let's put it right into where it needs to be. Now we can probably click and drag that down, but honestly, once when the, the emote's used, no one's gonna really notice that, that there's a blank area down here. Because it's transparent. Correct. Now we actually have another video where I show you how to change it out onto the various sizes. In fact, you're gonna go check it out over here in this next video and I show you how to kind of do all the resizing and dude, why don't we send them on over to that video so you see how we upload the Twitch emotes. Oh yeah. See yeah. you there.